There we go. Alright. Let's continue onwards. Now carrying the princess in her arm. I don't remember what's actually down this way. Oh, this is the way you come in, yeah. From the, uh... Whatever that creature is, the trolley creature. May as well fast forward because nothing's going on for a second here, I think. We gotta run all the way up, and then I think we gotta run all the way back down. No! There we go. Perfect time. Inconveniently, there's somebody here. This is the part where Steiner's entire la life, 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 his entire life falls apart. She's just tired. Let's take a, a brief period whilst trying to escape imminent doom and gently rest her. is the feeling of love. It is a strange feeling. Hi Beatrix. With the princess. And here we go again, round three against Beatrix, and guess what? It's a forced fail encounter. Have you gotten tired of those yet? Hey, we got a phoenix down! Good, because we're probably going to need those, unfortunately. Um, I mean, we may as well blow like some sword magic on her or something, I don't know. Obviously always cast slow, always cast rises wind whenever possible. Preferably before Freya dies. Oh, it missed. My god. Freya might die anyway, because this is just a basic regen, so. She's not immune to slow on this fight, is she? I don't think she is. Now, you've probably noticed this before, but uh, when Freya's in the air, in the middle of jump, I don't believe regen works. Unfortunately. Well, I think we've already managed to steal both of the items, actually. So we may as well try and burn this fight down as quickly as we can here. Nice 69 MP on two people now. And you can't do magic anymore, so... Steiner, if he gets hit again, might actually trance, which would be very convenient, because his trance is crazy powerful. Apparently not quite yet. It's also very close to death, and I don't think Rises Wind is back up. Did I already steal again? I don't think I did. Couldn't steal anything. Apparently, oh, missed. Apparently she has an item, because otherwise it wouldn't say I couldn't steal it. But I think we're, oh, we got a, like a phoenix down or something stupid. Well, this sucks. Yep, there goes Vivi. Unless you're way over leveled, it's not physically possible to tank shot. It just kills people. That is literally the entire purpose of shot. Oh, there goes two people. These are only in battle, right? Let's, uh, let's revive Freya. I don't know why, but... Oh, well, fight's over, so... 
Unfortunately, Vivi's still down, but that doesn't matter too much because I don't think we get AP from Beatrix fights anyway. What is your duty? You were just sleeping, it's alright. What is all this ruckus? Oh, hello. How are you on this fine day? Please do not harm the princess. So it's going to split our party up here. Along, honestly, quite capable lines. So it's going to be the four of us and then Beatrix and Freya. This is, I believe... The only point in the game where we have direct control of Beatrix. Unfortunately, her attacks when we're in control of her, as is tradition, are not nearly as good as the attacks when we're not in control of her. Having said that, she is ridiculously powerful. So, this is her special stuff. Physical, non-elemental, non-elemental thunder. Um... Obviously, shock is amazing. We don't need to use shock here. Oops. So we can just pop like a thunder slash or something for giggles. But we'll just normally attack. You can see her base damage is like triple everybody else in my party, except for Kina's max damage, but Kina's got some crazy variant. I believe it's also impossible to, um... Excuse me. I believe it's also impossible to look at Beatrix's gear, I think? I could be mistaken, though. So I think he just jumps down, because he's a filthy cheater. At least I thought he jumped down. Maybe it's somewhere else. Oh hey, it's mages. Now these, you've probably noticed, are upgraded mages. They have stabs. They're still just basic black mages, though, so... Well... Not necessarily basic anymore. They're relatively simple black mages, and Steiner is about to trance, so... Unfortunately, we don't have any summons, and she doesn't know a lot of magic, so she's pretty much useless right now. Also, Steiner is dying a horrible death at the moment. Don't worry, there is a solution to this, and it's called Fyra. Magic in this game is crazy powerful. 
At least our magic, not necessarily the enemies. You might die. In fact, you just trance, which is very poor timing on the dame's part. Hopefully, uh, Steiner doesn't trance too, because that would suck if he trances. Okay, good. It was a waste of Zidane's, because the big deal with Zidane's trance is it allows him access to really powerful AoE stuff. Potions aren't going to cut it for most of our abilities anymore. I'm not going to look at equipment right now. Doesn't matter that much. May as well fast forward it. We've been here before. Ah, there's the puppy that jumps down. And I think we, yeah, we fight two, unfortunately. Hopefully Steiner decides to, um... Actually trance, that would be lovely if he did so. Although, to be honest, I guess he doesn't really need to. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. So I just lost two turns because they put VV to sleep, which sucked. Hey, they missed. Alright, Steiner, hey, perfect. It's like I actually knew what I was doing, which is alarming, I know, it's highly unusual. We have so much ore, like freaking every encounter has been dropping ore. Run faster, Steiner. Indeed! We must go! No, 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 go. You forgot the go part. See, this is what happens when you don't go. Now we have to fight a stupid Bandersnatch without Steiner. I'm just gonna burn it to death anyway, doesn't really matter. Dagger, unfortunately, will do basically nothing. There you go. Good job, Dagger. You're a credit team. I need to get Zidane a new weapon at some point, which I think we should be able to do soon. If you sent this weapon, you, you're basically stuck with it for a very, very long time, which it kind of sucks, but... It's at least a good weapon. It carries you through the early game really easily. So this is the carnage that's going on behind us. Not going to be easy indeed. I may as well show off shock, because I don't think there's much left for her to save MP for. I could use Clem. Yeah, let's use Clem Hazard, because it's AoE. Plus, she never uses it in fights, I don't think. There you go. We win. Good job, team. We did it. They're tougher than I expected as we one shotted them. Hey, it's Steiner. Enough with your babble. Of course, we just we could just climb hazard again and kill everything. We're gonna use shock this time, though, if I have the MP for it, which I don't think I do. Nope. I do stock break, which I think just when she uses it, it puts everyone at one HP, but I don't remember what it does otherwise. Does AoE damage. Fair enough. Oh, come on, Steiner. You're making yourself look like a fool in front of Beatrix. Must you be so incompetent all the time? I just want to look at what Beatrix is wearing, but it won't let me. God dang it. 
Once we get back to the Trino or back to the closest save point, I'm probably gonna end all recording for today. Had a fair amount. I also got interrupted a bunch, so I probably skewed how much I'm recording. Rude? I mean, Thorn's not wrong. And of course, Marcus just doggy punches him. And there's good old Blink. There's no time, we have to save them. It's the princess. But also, yes, it is Zidane's new girl. But it's the princess. Marcus has got the world's greatest endurance, because he ran from Alexandria all the way to the forest, which is a fair run. And then, after saving Blank, ran all the way back to Alexandria. He's got the greatest endurance. It's kind of amazing, to be honest. Indeed it is, Gog and Rue. It's the Gargan. Hello, Gargan. Conveniently, it stops for us, despite the fact there's no food. We're going to Trino. Unfortunately, if you recall, there was an enemy in this tunnel. The one we fought earlier ran away. It was also much easier than this one, unfortunately. And now we have this thing. Which is a very similar enemy, it's just a different color, and its base tusks aren't wound up into a tight ball, but... I think this is the one of my cosplays, and we now have the advantage of being able to cast slow. Unfortunately, that's about the only advantage we have, because we don't have Protect or Shelga, so... Reacting to the attack. Oh, I forgot it does that. Did I actually slow it, or is it not slowed? It doesn't appear to be slowed. I wasn't paying attention. Yes. Stole the phoenix down. Make up for all the ones I've been using. All the, uh, all the ones, all the pennies I've been using. I'm pretty sure we can slow this thing. Maybe we can't. It's just been missing 24-7, so screw it, we're not slowing it. Oh, I forgot to cast AoE. I really should take Auto Potion off of BB. At some point. It still has an item, are you serious? Also, I forgot that restores 300 MP. That was a bit of a waste, but whatever. We can get Aethers later on fairly easily. Ultra Sound Wave. Silence? No, many. Okay, well. Many doesn't affect stealing, so whatever. I don't think it affects. I think it affects physical defense and physical attack. Nice mitts. I'm proud of you. Still couldn't steal anything, because the game hates my existence, apparently. I think at this rate, Vivi might kill it before we actually manage to steal that last item. Thundara, you say? Don't mind if I AoE heal. Again, really should take Auto Potion off of him at some point. As soon as we're out of this battle. 
There's not a huge reason to actually have him auto-proofing like that. Especially this early in the game, that's just so... I should have it for giggles, to be honest. Ultra Sound Wave! Hey, we have two miniature people now. Still couldn't steal anything. And it's already dead, so whatever other item it had, don't care. I like how Vivi was taller than both of them because of Mini. 7 AP from that is pretty good. The AP from bosses is nice, but it's not huge because you can just farm AP while leveling anyway, so... Yeah, don't yell at the Gorgon. Gorgon, whatever. It's going a bit too fast now. Oh hey, it's a snake. Oh yeah, we don't actually go to Trino yet, do we? That's right. I don't frankly know why they showed that scene, but whatever. With the Oglops walking around. We did indeed just pass Trino. The tunnel! Apologies for the frame rate here. This is the frame rate cinematic drama. It looks lovely, I know. And we're all dead. Mother. Help me. Their station has been lowered to less than the guards, apparently. It's always a good sign. I like how she just gestures violently. You two are dismissed. What does that mean? It means you can leave. You should go now, as the music completely shuts off. Oh. Oh, okay, that was strange. I think that black screen appeared way before what it was supposed to, actually. Again, with the violent gesture. I'm Lonnie. Yes, yes, you can flourish your weapon. Good job, it's an axe. Meanwhile, the other dude doesn't talk at all and just shoves people out of the way. Assassinate the black mage traveling with them. That's oddly specific. Kill her. Yeah, yeah, flourish your weapon. You don't need to do that, like, all the time. It's, it's completely unnecessary. Alexandrian fleet has returned to whole waters. And it should technically be like whole mayor space, shouldn't it? Because it's the red rose flies. In fact, I believe so does the rest of their navy, I guess, is what it is. 
Anyway, welcome to Pinnacle Rocks. I really would like a save point. I forgot how long chunks of this game go without a save point. Oh, hi, Vivi. Zidane's dead, though. That we are indeed. Unfortunately, I'm going to spoil it for you. We don't get an airship this early into the game. That would make the rest of the game a lot easier if we did. Yes. It's an Eidolon. Your summon magic destroyed Clara. What will you do now? Is that the correct answer? If I were more powerful. Hmm. Indeed. So we had to find the five uh, manifestations of him, which will each tell us a single piece of the story, and then we must take that story and put it in the correct order when we tell it back to him. Which isn't too hard, but it can be a little bit confusing with some of the specific pieces. I want, excuse me, I want mail. I want to save. Because that's all the recording I'm doing today. I was actually, I spent more time today recording than I was actually intending to do, but hey. To be fair, I haven't recorded in like a while, like two weeks or three weeks or something. Either way, thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time.